Right, Tracy. Well, just because the articles of impeachment were introduced today doesn't necessarily mean that the elected DA will be out of a job anytime soon. So the, um, the start of what could be a lengthy process includes setting up a legislature-led trial. Philly's lone Republican state lawmaker, Martina White, introduced a resolution today stating that the city's independently elected DA should be impeached. The reason, she says, misbehavior in office. His dereliction of duty and despicable behavior is unacceptable and will not be tolerated. The move in comments come months after a special House committee started investigating the DA's office. That committee released an interim report Monday that describes the city's grim statistics, an increase in homicides, a decrease in police officers, and an increase in the number of criminal cases that are withdrawn or dismissed in court. But the report did not recommend impeachment. And they will be continuing their work. There are some other things they need to do, but frankly, I don't know what you tell the people that live down there. Just... State House Majority Leader Representative Kerry Benninghoff stood in support of the impeachment resolution. He represents Center and Mifflin counties, but says the state has an obligation to take action on behalf of Philadelphia residents. It's not going to get better, and we're here to make an action. We requested to speak with D.A. Krasner following the impeachment resolution. In response, his spokesperson sent us a lengthy statement the D.A. issued last week. He says in part, it is astounding that this committee thinks it is appropriate to undo the will of Philadelphians, especially those who are black and brown and poor and young, because it believes it knows better what they need. The mere suggestion is paternalistic, offensive and racist. And as for the process to come on the impeachment, the resolution was referred to the House Judiciary Committee. And since today was the last day for session, the committee won't pick this back up until sometime in mid-November, once the House is back in session. Then, following a full House approval vote, the impeachment resolution goes to the state Senate, where a trial could be set up. In the newsroom, Claudia Vargas, NBC10 News.